Hello guys, it's me, Dark Rick PR. Nah, I'm making this video so you can see the the memory leak that the tablet Retina wants with the RK66 chipset have. Still, I haven't found a way to fix this right now. Well, as you can see right now, I'm not running. I just boot this system right now. You can see that I'm in 350 megabyte left, right? Let me click this so we kill some anything. Okay, 400. Okay, let's go to setting. Go to apps, and you will see that there is some kind of bug on the system UI. I'm not sure it's in the framework or where it is, but it looks like that this only happens to this tablet with this the the, the firmware or something. Right now I'm running my be my Dame Rig Beta. 4A and it's working very nice but there's some kind of bug with the interface that is doing that you get very fast without RAM okay let me focus this so you can see more okay okay 478 megabytes use and not running anything just the application that it booted with it 326 megabyte free okay you will see to this to start in uh, to start filling up very fast with just clicking here also the the system starts to kill some application to make more RAM left, but it doesn't work. That RAM that it's filling up, I am not sure where it is, it, but it will never return to free. You just fill it up, and that's it. The RAM starts to be unstable. You can see there's some application restarting by itself. Okay, those are the sor the the service, and you can see still run getting filled up, and I'm not running any kind of application. Just clicking the status bar, bar, and there it is. No RAM. All the applications are restarting, 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 restarting. And you will see that it will start to get unstable completely and I will have to only to shut it down. That's the only way to get the RAM back. Okay, you can see it says 92, but I feel that that's not the correct RAM left. I can kill and you will see it start to be unstable the tablet completely. You can see completely unstable and without using it just clicking the status bar. There's no way, it's not responding anymore. So as uh, you can see, anyone that haven't saw or understand the leak problem, you can see now with this video what really is memory leak. Uh, I can't
cannot no responding. I have to power it out of completely. Well as you can see that it is. Thank you guys for watching.